there today we have a fun filled activity which is making the moti chur laddus yummy isn't it let's see what do we have at the back of the book but before that let's read the instructions yes we have something at the back of the book and they are our moti chur laddus For this, we will require scissor, glue, and the paper provided in the book. Let's take the sheet of paper and keep it right here. Do you know what are we going to do with this? Yes, cut it. But before that, let's see how to hold our scissor. This is how we do it. Now we need to take our first two fingers and our thumb and hold our scissor like this. The bigger hole is going to have two fingers and the smaller hole is going to have your thumb. And why don't we move our hand like this? At first, let's start cutting in standing line. and then slowly start cutting at the outer part of the moti chur laddus make sure you keep the paper at this v and then move your hand and slowly close it close your scissor and open your scissor it is a rhythmic pattern and once you understand it it is going to be easier for you to cut it let's cut the next one open your scissor and close your scissor by keeping the paper in the v of your scissor This is simple isn't it Now cut the outer part in a similar way Why don't we complete cutting all of them together And at first we will place it Why are we placing first before sticking it So that we don't do a mistake Now let's take our glue and open the cap. Make sure you do not keep the cap of the glue open always or else your glue will dry. Now let's start putting four dots on the side line and then stick it slowly. Why don't we put all our laddus on top so that they don't bother us? That's lovely. Repeat the same step and start sticking it side by side. If you notice, we are going to stick four laddus at first. We will make sure that we stick the laddus on top of this line. Now it's time for us to put the next laddu in the middle of two. Now let's take the next moti chur laddu and stick it in between these. And finally, why don't we stick this right here in the middle of these two? We have three laddus in the second line. Now let's see how many do we put in the last line. We see one laddu in between two of these laddus and it is the same for all the three laddus. Now, let's take our final two laddus and start sticking in the middle of these two. That's amazing. Press it gently. And now, it's time for us to stick our final laddu. 
yes in the middle of these two. We see that one laddu is in the middle of two laddus. These laddus look delicious. Don't forget to close the cap of your glue. And your scissor as well or else you might get hurt.